guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, welcome. My name is Stephanie. Here on YouTube, I'm Steph Enchanted. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe right here. It's free and you can see all my future videos. Now for this look, as you can tell, it's for Halloween. I want to do a simple look, a look that didn't take too much effort and that was easy. And especially towards the people who don't want to go all out for Halloween, like they don't want to wear a wig or they don't want to go like crazy with color. I thought this was nice and simple. Uh, but still very wearable. Um, you can do any color you want. I just picked the white because I feel like it's standing out more than black. And so, yeah, just do your take on it. Um, if you recreate this look or any of my looks, please tag me in all your photos. I would love to see them. And if you want to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. You guys can tell I already did my face makeup, my foundation, concealer, bronzer, and my eyebrows. I'll leave everything down below so you guys can check that out. My lid, I'm taking the lightest shade in the Wet n Wild Contour palette in Caramel Toffee and then I'm taking a darker shade and putting it in my crease and just blending it upwards. So I'm making my wing liner with the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper. I'm just going to basically do like a winged liner, a little bit longer than I usually do just to give it more of a cat eye effect. For my spider web, I'm using the NYX liquid liner in the shade white. I'm basically just doing lines out of the outer corner of my eye. This is not be perfect because we're going to add more things later on. We're going to add the inner part of the web and I'm basically just doing like an upside down tiny U and putting it in between all of the lines. Again, it doesn't matter if you like mess up or anything because you can go over it and plus we're going to be blending it out later on. And of course I get it in my hair. <laughs> I'm going to add another spider web, but on the other side and on my forehead just to kind of like balance it out. And of course I get it on my hair again. <laughs> so I'm basically just doing the same thing. I'm making the lines first and then I'm going to fill it in using the U's. I don't know why, but this one was so much easier to do than the one on my cheek. Next, I'm taking the Lorac Pro 2 palette and I'm taking the shade Charcoal. And I'm taking my Bamboo Eco Tools pencil brush and I'm basically just going over the lines. Just give it a little bit more depth. I'm using the same charcoal shade. I'm just going to go over a couple of the inner parts of the web. Not all of them because I'm going to blend it out. I'm using the shade Snow from the Lorac Pro 2 palette and I'm going to take my Real Techniques buffing brush and I'm just going to buff it in just to blend all of the shades, the white eyeliner and the charcoal shade. Now I'm just doing the same thing, I'm taking the charcoal shade with the pencil brush and lining all of the lines and then I'm going to blend it out using the shade Snow with the same blending brush. I'm adding the next roll on shimmer in the shade platinum just because I want more glitter. <laughs> and I'm just taking the Real Techniques um, pointed concealer brush and just blending it all out. Now I'm just going over some of the lines with the white eyeliners because it kind of like faded away just to be more prominent. My lash, I'm starting out with the e.l.f. mascara primer as usual. I'm using the Pure Cosmetics Volume Vixen 4-in-1 mascara. 
And as kind of a highlight, I'm using the Rowan Shimmer and Platinum from NYX. I'm just putting this on the other cheek that where there is no web. My lips, I'm using the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in the shade Hello. I don't know why, but this part, it just tickled me. <laughs> And now I'm using the NYX Liquid Eyeliner in white to draw the spider. I'm first starting with the head on my upper lip. I'm basically just drawing a circle and filling it in. For the body, I'm starting out with the wider upper part and then drawing it to a point on my bottom lip and just filling it in. I'm starting off with the legs. Now I know in some parts I come off the frame and you can't really see what I'm doing. I apologize, it's my first time doing something on my lips like this, but I promise I'll get better. I'm basically just drawing um, the legs. I'm going in with the cream makeup in white. Oh, I got this from Target. I'm just taking like a little brush and I'm going over the whole entire spider just to make it more opaque. Again, I'm taking the shade Charcoal from the Rock Pro 2 palette with my pencil brush. I'm just basically adding a little bit of the shade onto the spider just to add more depth. I'm going to blend that out using the shade Snow from the same Rock Pro 2 palette. Because the spider needs some sparkle, I'm going to add the NYX um, Roll-On Shimmer in Platinum. The lashes that I use for this look are the Vegas Nate Shining Star. And this is the final look. And that's it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. That way I know what kind of videos you guys want to see from me. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Bye. <laughs> look at Mom, you look so funny, there's you. I look funny. I look funny. You look like there's you fucking you're like a monster. Okay. <laughs>